Hello Pisces, welcome to your reading. This is a three card, pick a card, yes or no tarot reading for the water sign of Pisces. I'm Kathy, welcome to my channel. Hope you're all doing great. And thank you so much for joining me today and watching my video. This, uh, I want you to, as I'm shuffling and setting my focus on your answer, uh, I want you to focus on your question, your yes or no question. Just be forming it and concentrate on it and be aware of your question as I shuffle. And this will be a quick yes or no. Uh, I'll also draw from my beautiful little bowl here that I got at Ross yesterday. Measure your life in love. And it's got affirmations in it and I'll be pulling one of those for you. And also we'll pull a card from the Angels answer deck okay so I'll give you a few moments as I shuffle to form your question and then we'll lay three cards out here for you to pick from give a cut Card two, card three. And I'll give you a few moments to see which one resonates with you. Card one, card two, card three for your yes or no answer to your yes or no question, okay? For those of you who picked card one, the answer to your yes or no question, and I guess I better clear this up. If I turn the card over and it's in the reverse position, that's a no. If it's in the upright position, that's a yes. That's the way I do my three card readings I learned from a very wonderful lady. But here we go. The answer to your yes or no question is a yes. You got the four of wands. Looks like it's time to celebrate celebrate a holiday <laughs> yes whatever you've got in mind that you're needing I feel like you wanted a yes answer you know sometimes we want to know you know like I don't want that so I want to know but uh, I feel like with this celebration card that you definitely wanted a yes so there you go <laughs> a yes for you and okay we'll draw a one of these and we'll see what it says for you um these are my little homemade um uh, affirmations i use them daily <laughs> and um uh, i don't need these of course because i have them all in my head but yours says life is safe for me to live and this is a very good thing to say probably at night when you're trying to sleep and all your cares and concerns come alive in your little head um, and it, it's a scary world sometimes, you know, we not only concern for our own lives, but we're but all those we love, you know, so I say life is safe for me to live. And I also say uh, I'm safe in every area of my life. I am well sound and whole in every area of my life. All those I love are safe in every area of their lives and they are well sound and whole in every area of our lives we have to add them because most of the time our concerns are about them so this is a good uh, affirmation for you life is safe for me to live and maybe you're coming out of a situation that you were concerned about and it's going to be a yes for you and big changes are coming you can be happy again you can dance again okay and we'll see what we have for you here. This may add to the reading. It may address a whole different situation. There's so many situations we can get into in our lives, aren't there? <laughs> so, I'm just going to give a quick cut. And we'll grab one right off the top. It's up to you. I tell people this all the time. You know, we want to play the game, the blame game. <laughs> but really, when it's all said and done, it's, out, it's up to us to attract into our reality that which we want and to um, 
put a wall up around ourselves, a wall, a hedge of protection to protect us from anything negative. And one of the things I always say is um, I only allow positive people and situations into my life. I resist all forms of negativity and evil coming against me. I mean, this is another good affirmation, but it's up to you to do this. Nobody's going to do this for you, okay? Because everybody's dancing fast they can, and they're trying to just live their own lives and have some kind of peace. Um, so this is up to you. This is good advice for you today, Pisces. Okay, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope this helped you. I believe that it will. For all of you that picked card two, the answer, well, I'm going to, if you miss the introduction, then you miss this part. If the card is in the upright position when I turn it over, then that's a yes. If it's in the reverse position, that's a no. Also, I will draw you an affirmation from my beautiful little Measure Your Life and Love bowl. I got this at Ross yesterday. I absolutely love it. And we will pull a affirmation for you, and we will also pick a card from the angel answers okay so the for all of you that picked the number two card the answer to your yes or no question is a yes a yes you should take that pause <laughs> you should take a break you should look at this situation from a different angle from a different perspective um and it's up to you, of course. The hangman is all about waiting and just having to wait. So, yes, you're going to have to wait, but yes, you're going to get the answer you need, okay? It's a yes. That's a yes card. So, we'll pull an affirmation for you. We'll take this one. I write these down, and norm I have them all in my head, really, so I hardly ever pick through this bowl, but... I am beautiful on the inside and out. So if you have any doubts about your beauty and your preciousness <laughs> and your worthiness and your uh, deserving, you are deserving of all good things in your life, okay? So never doubt yourself and never put yourself down. Um, always bring yourself up, okay? Because if you don't, nobody else will most likely. Um, you are beautiful inside and out. Claim that, receive it, be grateful for it. And if there's anything you feel like you need to forgive yourself about, just say, I love you, please forgive me, thank you. I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you. That's the whole aponopono. But you are beautiful in every area of your life, so start living like you believe that, okay? Start living your life like you really believe that. And we'll pick one of these for you. Oh, well, somebody jumped out, so we'll see what it says. Take action. Yes. Take action to believe in yourself, to have confidence. That's another affirmation. I am confident. But if this is uh, some kind of, uh, I kind of feel like this is some kind of love interest that you're kind of waiting on to see if it works out or if it um, will manifest. And I'm going to say, yes, your patience will pay off. You'll see this person in a different light, and I feel like it will motivate you to make that move. It's okay if you make the first move, okay? So that's your reading, Pisces. Thank you so much for joining me and watching my video. Okay, all of you that picked card three, for your yes or no question. Your yes or no answer to that question is a yes. You got a yes, and you got the chariot card. It's a major arcana. So uh, it's, you're going to progress with all your determination and finally taking control <laughs> of the situation. As long as you were letting the horse rule the, you know, the the situation out of control, you weren't going to uh, be beneficial. It's not, what is it going to be beneficial to you? You take charge of your life again and move forward in a positive way, in a direction you want to go. Yes, you got some opposing forces that are trying to run away with you. 
<laughs> but don't let it happen. Speak up for yourself. Take control. Take your power back, okay? Somehow you've let your power uh, go, but you can get it back. There's nothing you can't be, do, or have that you choose. So don't uh, lay down and take that, okay? And we'll pick a affirmation for you. I'll take this one. In my beautiful little measure your life and love bowl. I got this at Ross yesterday, and I just love it. I throw my little affirmations up in here. I only give my energy to things that add to my growth. Now, that goes good with this... Uh, card here you only give energy to the things that add to your growth so this is a this will add to your growth is to move forward put your energy in the right place use it more wisely you've been using your energy in the wrong way probably and it's time to uh, get on board and go forward in a more positive direction the direction you want to go like I said and we will Draw one of these cards for you. This will uh, add to the reading or it may address a whole different issue, but these are the answer, Angel Answers uh, Oracle cards. Love these cards. Of course, I love all my cards. <laughs> I have so many. Let's see what this one says for you. Peaceful Resolution. Okay. Maybe that's why you had a whoops, had a problem with uh, taking control of the situation. It's because it was so chaotic and so forceful and just so uh, overwhelming. Uh, but you're going to have a you yes answer, and it's going to be a peaceful resolution. It's going to be way more peaceful than you ever imagined. So start being grateful now, thankful, blessed. Yes, this worked out. I'm so grateful. Put yourself in that place of gratitude and positivity and think only on the result you want and not on the result that you do not want. Okay, and that's your reading, Pisces. Thank you so much for watching my video and until the next video. Bye-bye.